Me and Vince are right in the Attitude Era. You know, Jim's still doing his Memphis stuff. And he wanted to bring in Terry Funk. So he suggested the idea of putting Terry Funk in a box and leaving him ringside the entire show. And people are wondering, you know, what's in the box, what's in the box. And, and I, I remember this like it was just a, because you don't forget a quote like this. And this isn't like to poke fun. This is one of the greatest quotes of all time. Jim, Jim sat there and told me and Vince, anybody who comes out of a box is instantly over. And like we just had to, I mean, that's priceless. I mean, that, if I could make that up, I should be a Hollywood writer right now. So Vince took that. And for some reason, I think he wanted to take away from Jim that we're going to use Terry Funk. And I think, like I said, there may have been a back history where there was a little heat with Terry Funk. So Vince came up with the idea of, okay, we'll put him in a box, but it's not going to be Terry Funk that comes out. It's going to be Chainsaw Charlie. Now, Cornette, like, was, like, he could not even believe, like, did this, Terry Funk is Jesus to Cornette. So he couldn't even believe Vince was suggesting this. I'm sitting there, like, realizing, like, I think this is the stupidest thing I've ever heard in my life, Chainsaw Charlie, but I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm also picking up the vibes from Vince and the stuff that he's saying that there's more here than meets the eye. You know, remember, remember back in the day when Vince made Dusty come out in the yellow polka dots? Sure, it, it, to me, it was like that kind of a moment. Right. So like I really didn't say anything. Thus, Chainsaw Charlie. When Vince comes up with the name. He has the name Chainsaw Charlie ready and all that. Yes.